Serbian nationalist leader Vojislav Šešel has drawn a crowd of thousands to Belgrade's main square just days after being released by a UN war crimes court, which is still trying to reach a verdict on his trial. The 60-year-old Šešel, who is suffering from cancer, has vowed revenge against ex-allies now in power. The worst politicians are now in power, and who are they? Our, till recent, closest associates, our comrades. That's the wound which hurts the most. Those who were in the first lines of battle for Serbs and greater Serbia, now they are in favor of Americans and others from the West. Šešel has rejected closer integration with the EU, in spite of Serbia opening membership talks with the 28-nation bloc earlier this year. And that's why the Serbian Radical Party wants bigger integration with Russia and its allies, Belarus, Kazakhstan and others. We don't want European Union membership. We don't want to cause conflict with the European Union. We want economic cooperation, but on equal terms. Šešel was a hardline proponent of the nationalism that fueled wars in Bosnia, Croatia and Kosovo during the breakup of Yugoslavia, in which a total of more than 120,000 people died. The families of those who lost their lives in the conflict say they have been shocked and dismayed by his release.